Hey Talia. How you doing? Yeah. Good. Now this is the famous Talia Katz. She is a artist extraordinaire and also an aspiring interior designer. She has a plethora of knowledge in the area of design and aesthetics and she knows many of the styles. In fact, uh, some people have doubted her abilities but we know that it is not wise to do that because Talia is an expert in this area. Now Talia, tell me what is your favorite style in interior design? Talk to us about this. Modern. Now, what is it about the aesthetics of modern that pleases you as an artist? Well, it's very simple, very graphic, you know, very nice, bright, sometimes bright colors, but I use like a modern, mod, like black and brown and stuff like that for a, pop, a punch of color. Uh huh. Um, and I like it because it's, I like the simple things, and, um, I like having a color that just stands out in the room. Like, if, every, if the walls are neutral and the furniture is neutral and you have this one piece of art and um, accessories that just have a different color and pop out, and it's, it's a very happy thing to have in a room. It's almost as if the color speaks to you, isn't it? Yeah. And what, does, what it, would you say is the color that really sends you, takes you to the moon. Purple, and I like blue, and I also like red. Talk to me about these colors. What is it about them? That well, blue with red works, purple with blue works, um, red with purple works, and basically they all work together, and they've just been my favorite color. I just love the color. I'm not sure how to explain why I love the color. I just love the color. And my room is actually bamboo type furniture with purple and blue walls. Lovely. Now if if the these colors could make a sound, what sound would they make? Well, it'd almost be like jazz music with a electric loud guitar spiced in there. Can you give us an example? What do you mean? Kind of like can you make the sound? I don't know how to make the sound of jazz. That's how mysterious it is. Ah, the mystery of jazz is what you like. Yes. Wow. Yes. Now tell us about this painting. You are doing an incredible piece here. I'm going to get a little close-up of this incredible piece. Look at that. Now tell me about the color combinations in this piece. Well, it is based on that painting over there, which ah, is... let's look at this. ...based on a peacock. Uh-huh. That was the inspiration, I see. Yes. And this is an inspiration of a wind chime I saw. It was, um, trees made out of different shapes. So I thought, why not make a painting of a tree made out of different shapes? So I just took all the colors, you know, um, different shades of green, and I am coloring them in, huh. and the background will match it, and so will the trunk. And um, and it's very graphic, like my kind of style. And some of the colors are matching that painting over there. I see. So yeah. Fantastic, Talia. I have to say, you have your prodigy, which means that you're pretty darn talented. And we were talking about underestimating the youth of today and that you found that the adults just don't seem to think that you know what's going on, but it sounds like you do. Yeah. So what is the message? If you could give a message to the adults of today, what would it be? If a child's trying to correct you, she'd probably listen. Mmm. Preach it, sister. Preach it. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you, Talia. It's been a pleasure. It, the honor and the pleasure is mine. 